Jones. What's happening? This your boy Joe Black. I'm here to tap in with y'all and let y'all know exactly what I'm slapping. What is really, really cracking right now. Um, if y'all ain't enough on it, check the homegirl Scooby D with Patience Come Greatness. Only available in hard copy with features from Don Elway, uh, So Fast, Speaker Box. Uh, man, it's, it's, her, her features are so monster. Asia from Compton. So shout out Asia. Um, tap into her social media, get you a hard copy. And that's one of the things that I'm streaming. However, what I'm off of, off of, and I can't even front. Um, a lot of people might hate. Big shout out to Whitey Bulger with that feature with Hardini. Night seems longer. Uh, why did it transform from culture vulture <laughs> to artist? Shout out to the homie Whitey and Hardini. Say One, Be The One by L Love, Fire. It's a bunch of independent fire being released and dropped. If y'all ain't up on it, visit us at highendradio.com. Google Monster TC4, TC3, Off The Porch, Another Banger. Love yours. The niggas is doing that shit. Where they, where they broadcasting? Live from the Deuce? Live from the Deuce. Yeah. I'm on the Deuce with my dudes, nigga. Just like that. <laughs> Man. Um, and a shout out to Nick Miller, Roddy Rich from Letter to Nipsey. Yes, sir. The song is fire. There it is there. Yeah. Believe that. Um, D Smoke, no commas. Uh, it's a gang of fire out there. I'm telling y'all, man. Uh, don't have me pull my phone up. And just, man, I can enlighten y'all, retighten y'all, because I ain't got time to be fighting y'all. Follow us on highendradio.com, on Instagram, high underscore and underscore radio one. Mr. K for radio host. Um, we'll be tapping back in with some events coming up shortly. Stay tuned. If you ain't logged in, you probably logged out. It's your boy Joe Black. I ain't radio or hip hop bangs. Boom. Boom, what's happening? You already know what it is. It's your boy Joe Black. And I'm your man, Mr. Kafer. Where are they tapped into? Highendradio.com. We back. Last week, bloggers is blogging snitching. <laughs> we getting a lot of crazy comments and responses about yeah, that. Yeah. I mean, hey, it is what it is. We know what we do here. And we will be doing no snitching. No snitching. Straight up. Yeah. We ain't even gonna tell motherfuckers to stop snitching. We ain't doing no snitching. Yeah, who well, no. <laughs> I'm gonna tell you stop snitching. Hey, you know, at the end of the day, it is what it is. We back for another week. That part. We talking remixes. We talking MC8 is not one of the dopest MCs. He's not. But he pioneered this West Coast. Yes, yeah, he's not. Hip-hop. He's one of your least favorite. Me, I beg to differ. Um, eight was. It's me coming up was the soundtrack to my west to my west coast living. You feel me? Him. Look at the uh, part. D D. Wow, you're going there, huh? You're going with the DJ Quick Line E I H T. Let me continue. And you left out the G because the G ain't in you. That's how you feeling. Man. But did he ever respond to that song? He had a song against Quick, bro. It was that, quick. That it was very quick. Okay. But at the same time. I'm listening, to, I'm watching Mr. Society the other day, and eight, you know, the fucking straight up minutes comes up in that movie. You know, this is this is a few days or a week after uh, after Kobe's passing. You know, after you know, just after seeing Kane and Kane and uh, Sharif shot, it just all hit me at once. I broke down, I broke down singing them lyrics to that to that song, bro. Mm-hmm. MC eight 
is that nigga. Like to me, feel me? May not be everybody's favorite, mm-hmm. but he was the he was the pioneer and the soundtrack to a lot of West Coast music. Absolutely, music to drive by. That part, you feel me? You know, duck set. Yeah, all, I'm not gonna front like I don't. Don't you know, fuck with A. Quit fuck with A. Yeah. Um, I'm not gonna front like he did not leave his imprint in this game. He's just your least favorite artist. If you follow. Dante Simone on Facebook, I put my 10 least favorite rappers. Not wack, it's just not wack, it's just least favorite. I may know two or three songs by some of these rappers. Um, however, Blueface made the list, son. Huh? You better believe it. Y'all made it twice. <laughs> um, but I'm gonna tell you, really made that list? Oh, the dude that raps after I rock on something about the South I, I seen that. I don't even know who the fuck that is. Bitch, man. I don't know. <laughs> Tiny do know who he is. Quiet. Um, however, the dog, the dog thought he was, um, he was the, the, <laughs> the wackest nigga too. On the real, the majority, <laughs> when you say wackest, I said, see, least he's favorite. The, least favorite. Uh, oh, wow. <laughs> yeah. It was crazy though. Um, shout out Bethel Perez 95.7 He's killing it in the morning in San Diego Our heart radio Giving it up for high end radio I can't even Man I can't even He doing his shit He got slung into a position And he's working it out Good morning yeah, man, Taking the ball and running with it Bro like, like I I Don't listen to the radio And find myself back Turning on the radio Just based on Bet though, and I don't know if he's changing the program and what they're playing. I mean, it's iHeart, so iHeart definitely has the top 40 list of what's hot. Yeah, Every yeah. iHeart radio station plays that. Let's not get it twisted. Mm-hmm. But with Bet though on the air, it just feels right. It feels genuine. You feels know like saying? WBLS yeah, like, yeah, back in the 80s yeah, 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 on some New York hip hop yeah, shit. Because Bet though, you know, he got he got that flavor. You know what I mean? He's a Latino brother who got real flavor, and he mm-hmm. does it from one end to the other. So shout out to Bet though. Um, we just gonna keep this shit going, man. We got a lot of dope shit to talk about. Uh, shout out to the uh, hold it, no, that list. Okay, why was the NBA player every NBA player that tried to rap not your uh, your okay. least favorite? Okay, I don't know that because right Damian really Lillard, three. Damian Lillard got bars. Cedric Sabalos. Oh God. Shaq Diesel and AI. Shaq went platinum. Sorry. With DJ Quick. Uh, and with the Fushnickin. Was prior to his basketball career. Come on, man. So he was a rapper already. Shaq was uh, rapping. Rest in peace, Cole, but I think he tried it too, didn't he? He tried it. And so literally, way literally, better basketball player. And literally, he tried it. Rest in peace. Just like, <laughs> just like I was at the, we was at the YG All-Star Function mm-hmm. basketball tournament. And this is my opinion. Nip, you're a way better rapper. Rest in peace. Than a basketball player. Yeah. So, I get it. At the end of the day, you know. Um, Being tall don't give you a jump shot. Not at all. Just, you know, I don't want to call rappers whack because that's their crack. I'm not fond of some of their songs. Yeah. Yeah. I'm not fond of them overall because I can give you top 10 of some monsters. Right, right, right. But later for that, you had a dope interview with Tasha Williamson, Tasha Williamson the mayor, Democratic mayoral candidate for San Diego Black First. African American female. female to run for that female seat, president. man. Right. So, um, that's that's a big look. It's a good look for uh, for the city. Um, she got a tough battle to fight. Uh, she wasn't the Democratic uh, nominee. They didn't nominate her to be to, to represent them. They uh, nominated Todd Gloria. Uh, we'd like to get him on the show as well. If he got time, he'd come on the show. We can come to where you are. It's not an issue. We'll pull up, Todd. We'll, we'll definitely pull up, Todd. So Todd is a San Diego High alumni, too. So he, he was very implemental. Yeah, in, in try, yeah, 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 yeah. Logan shit. Logan shit. <laughs> he, was, he, was, so he understands it. He gets it, too. Yeah, he gets it. And and he was very implement toll in trying to keep San Diego High open. They were trying to close the day, though. And yeah. he, he, he stood firm in helping to do that. So shout out to him for that, but Let's get on the show, man, and discuss some of these issues. We, we definitely want to see uh, how yours differ from hers. Now, shout out to Tasha Williamson for definitely coming on the show and giving Big us up. everything that she had. And she left the right on this table, so definitely. Uh, Where's it at? Huh? Is it still here? Yeah, it's still here. Okay. Um, Richard and Earl. I want Cats to learn something from E-40 and Richie Rich. Mm-hmm. Policy. 
stuck on my way, stuck on my way, that's how I gotta be. I'm stuck on my way, stuck on my way, that's how I gotta be. It's still gonna set you. They're moving your heart, they don't hear with apology. They don't look at it.